Uh -huh, I want to know the answer to this Wait. one. <laughs> Do you sneak out of the house to see your boyfriend when your auntie is not around? Describe your auntie's marriage in three words. Tell us one shady thing you have done while living in my house. What is the most annoying thing I have ever done to you? <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Are you laughing? <laughs> In today's video, I'm going to be asking Amarachi, she's on the hot seat. I should have put fire on that seat. <laughs> Amarachi is on the hot seat today and she's going to be answering some awkward questions truthfully. If not, turn down. <laughs> you guys, Amarachi has a channel in case you don't know. It's called Amarachi Isaiah and I'm going to put the link in the description box. So please go and check out her channel and also subscribe and you know join her family <laughs> join hey, the family so. <laughs> yeah uh, but what do you have to say introduce yourself hey guys my name is amarachi i'm in this is channel today yay you two look amazing thank, oh, you. thank you all right <laughs> now the question are you currently dating somebody <laughs> it's not laugh we didn't come here to laugh we came here to answer <laughs> Are you currently dating someone? Bear in mind that <laughs> hell is real. <laughs> okay. Yes. Will you marry for money or for... Wait, do I even know who you're dating? Is it that person that I know? Uh, or a new person? No, that person. Okay. Okay, so will you marry for money or for love? Really? Yes, yeah, so this one is difficult for you to answer. <laughs> wow. Wow. This generation. This Gen Z. Hey! And you see, definitely love, but the money must be there. If there's no money, then what are you going to do? Will you go there and suffer? No, you go there and love now. Love is important. You sure, love without money. <laughs> yeah, but that's a good answer, please. It's not like love without money, I beg, because that, that love will disappear the moment people start going through too much. I'm not saying that you should marry. Okay, my advice to you, anyway, is that don't marry because of money. And if you love somebody and the person is, you know, has good prospects, you can also go ahead. You don't have to wait for him to be a rich man first, okay? But the prospects should be there. Now, this next one is how do you handle online stalkers? Do you have online stalkers? I don't have anyone. You don't have online others, baby? Hi, 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 baby. Oh, Hello, hi. baby. Okay. Hello, baby. Hello, <laughs> baby. <laughs> I block you. Uh, it's all of them you used to block Amarachi. So you don't need to respond. Hey! Amarachi said the truth. So you don't until actually I used to block people. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm. <laughs> uh -huh. I want to know the answer to this one. Do you sneak out of the house to see your boyfriend when your auntie is not around? No. She can't even do it. There are cameras in this house. You explain to me where you are carrying yourself to. No. But your boyfriend is not even around now. He's not like no. here. So I'm sure when she's in school, only God knows how how the amount of time you spend in school versus you spend with him. But <laughs> let's pretend that when you're in school, you're just there doing school things. Let's pretend. Let's move on. Where do you see yourself in five years? <clears throat> in five years. Obviously, by that by that time I would have I would have graduated from school. Maybe I've been working by then. If I got this. Okay. When was your first kiss? Answer, I'm not even trying to help you out in this one. You must to answer. <laughs> um, I Can I even remember, I Seth? Just, no, no, it's this year. Eh. Yes, this year. Amarachi, Amarachi. <laughs> this is this year. Okay. Um, hmm. <laughs> Have you ever disliked any of my videos and you never told me? No. I want to say the truth, don't worry. I will not get angry. It's normal. <laughs> Just let no, me know. No, no, no. Are you sure? Yes. Do you even watch my videos? That's yes. the first question I'm supposed to ask. Yeah. I do watch, but not always. Yeah. Okay. What is the most annoying thing I have ever done to you? <laughs> Answer, you know that that reminds me, you guys on her channel, we're going to have the opposite of this on her channel, and I'm going to answer her questions honestly as well. So spill it out. What's the most annoying thing I've ever done to you? I, did I have to answer? 
Yes, you have to answer. It's by force. We'll wait. Oh. And don't sugarcoat it. Don't be thinking of one soft thing to say so that you're not saying, I don't really get angry. It's just, uh -uh. say it, say it as it is. What's the most annoying thing I've ever done to you? It's nothing annoying though. But hey, I'm not to that. That's a big lie. That's a massive lie. Like just the. Um, it's just the shouting. That is. That's the most annoying thing I've ever done to you. I hardly get angry. Uh, it's not about whether you got angry yeah. or not. The thing that I did was annoying, but you just said, let me just, let me just overlook. Let me just move on. Let me not get angry. Say it. <laughs> and see, it's actually when um, Cora does, um, let me see, the children mm. does something and now shout at them that we have no idea, I don't like this. Yes, I shout at you on that behalf because you are the adults there. When you are adults there and our children are misbehaving, so why are you there? Why you okay? The Cora will start babysitting you now, so that I'll shout out Cora too. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, man, I can be annoying, sure. and I know when I'm, I'm being annoying, and I do it on purpose so that people will know. Jesus. Yes, I do it on purpose because sometimes they used to forget themselves, so I need to increase the annoyingness so I to remind you, bring you back to reality. What do you dislike about your auntie? And don't say shouting. Because that's your, your simplest answer for everything. Shouting. That one, everybody knows about shouting parts. That one is normal. Say the other. Uh, okay, aside shouting, okay. what do you dislike about your auntie? I'm just not shouting. So, aside shouting, I'm perfect. Shouting. Even with the shouting, I'm perfect. Please. <laughs> I know it's always shouting you say, but for me, I know that there are other things, but let's just, let's just move on. So, I was asking, are you guys related? No way, I'm not related. We're not even from the same. Stay it safe, but we're both Igbos, okay? Okay. We say AA and I'm Oh, it's yes. true. <laughs> if you could only eat one food for the rest of your life, what would you choose? One. Mm -hmm. I have two. Oh, yeah, no. Indomie and rice. <laughs> yes, uh, I, I agree about that one. Indomie, especially. <laughs> this people can eat Indomie morning, afternoon, night, evening, snack. What's your favorite part of your daily routine? Sleep. <laughs> After the kids go to school and they finish their work, sleep. One day after the two of them, this is why people don't sleep at night. Me, I'll be awake throughout the day. Even at night, sometimes I'll be awake. But these people smart in sleep. When you go to school, what are you doing? I'm sleeping. I'm going it's... to sleep now. Don't have anything to do. Is that asleep or I'll go and watch TV? Okay. Is that your favorite part of your daily routine? Yes. Okay. <laughs> if you had unlimited time, how would you spend it? Sleeping. What, <laughs> what is the best advice someone has given you? Anyway, if you had unlimited free time, how would you spend it? Unlimited free time, that many other things to do with your life. Nah, you just said that sleeping. Okay. You don't need to sleep. <laughs> What's the best advice someone has ever given you? The best advice is know your purpose in life. Mm. You're not like giving that yourself. Oh, okay. All right. Who would you rather go on a date with, Bonner Boy or Whiskey? I like Nigerian musicians, so, but I don't crush on any of them. They don't say whether you have crush. They say who no, would you rather go on? Choose one. It's by force. <laughs> <laughs> you must choose one. This question is basically almost like who do you prefer amongst the amongst. two? Mm. I'll go with Bonner Boy. Yeah, me too. Even though you're not asking me, Shab, I'll go with Bonner Boy. <laughs> okay, which which tribe do you want your husband to be from? Mm. Uh, Ida Rivers, mm, Delta, but any other place? Any other place aside from Northern States. Mm -hmm. Keep an open mind, though. Yes. Mm -hmm. Keep an open mind. <laughs> don't be saying, don't be doing that one in this day, in this 2022, or in this modern times. So yeah, keep an open mind, yeah. But personally, I I rather I prefer people marrying from similar. Cultures. It doesn't have to be the same state. It doesn't have to be the same tribe per se, but similar cultures in general. So I get that part. It makes things easier. But if you know sin, I go marry the one way you see. Okay, what age were you when you had your first crush? My first crush is let me who and <laughs> oh my god of mercy. I'm tired of that guy. <laughs> that was my first crush. My celebrity crush actually. Um, uh, when that's watching Korean movies, what is the longer? Like how old? Can you guess how old you were? Mm, 
Tell us this question. <laughs> Tell us one shady thing you have done while living in my house. Okay, it must not be a very terrible thing. Just one time you disobeyed her silently. And when she's is calculating her options, she's like, if I see this one, nah, I start trouble. Any if I see that I'm one, nah, I start trouble. I've never done anything. <laughs> hey, should I tell them? <laughs> Should I tell them the list is plenty, but just tell me the one that maybe I don't know about, or just just think of one, Sham. Yes, I think having um, is it like should I put it self? The relationship I have with the workers in the house and okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We've addressed that one, Sham. When do you plan on leaving my house? And what was the reason you became a help? It's a very good question, actually. When do you plan on leaving? Yeah, I haven't even thought of that. Like, not any times. <laughs> As it was serious. As it was serious. Me, I used to ask myself that question. Like, when do I want to leave? For now, I don't have any answers to it. Okay. What was the reason you became a help? Condition. <laughs> but that's the answer now. It's not condition. It's condition now. It's not something that people. Do people really have... Does anybody go through life thinking, okay, when I finish secondary school, I'll go and... And when I came back, I started looking for, like, minding work. Eh? Hey. Okay. Oh, really? I started looking for... I, the, the day I came, I mm. bought a call from a school. Oh. School. Oh, you wanted to do minder in school? Eh. Hey. Hey. Is that how you like children? Do you really like children like that? Mm -hmm. It's a marriage. But I'm actually like children, Sha. Would you rather never have kids or never make a lot of money? Which one? If they tell you to choose, you'll never make money in this life, but you'll have kids, or you as in a lot of money, or you'll never have kids, but you'll make a lot of money. I won't give birth to any child, but I'll adopt. Did not say give birth. <laughs> yes. You like money too <laughs> much, I'm <laughs> See logic. <laughs> My mind did not even go to yourself. So logic, no, but they say they say have kids, so that's adoption, no. And <laughs> I don't really have kids and have money to train them. We just give birth and kids and I'm the person to support. Yeah, that's true, Sha. Yeah. So you rather have money than have kids, and that's what it means. I adopt. No adoption here. <laughs> Either the money or the kids. Finish. Okay, this one is do you have any any regrets? And I, I mean I want to know the answer. I said, do you have any regrets in life? I don't have any regrets. Mm -hmm. Answer seriously. Don't answer mm. surface surface. I don't have any regrets. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Mm. What are you most grateful for living with me? The answer, don't say everything, no. We don't want diplomatic answer. Exactly. We don't want all those surface surface uh, free free answer. Deep, real answer. What are you most grateful for living with me? The fact that you care a lot about me. Who told you? Auntie, do not. I cannot deny you. I cannot deny you. I cannot deny about whatever. <laughs> you know me, I don't like all this kind of uh, mushy mushy things. Moving on. <laughs> Next, <laughs> hmm, this is a good question, though. Hey, mm. you people are serious, so mm. this next question is Describe your auntie's marriage in three words and tell me two things you've learned from my marriage. Happy, I'm really curious. So, really, yeah, okay, happy, mm -hmm. happy. Yeah, it sounds, it sounds confusing. Okay, just okay, describe it in maybe three sentences. In some marriages, I've seen people like, like husbands beating their wives, but mm. my marriage is different. Yeah, I've been, like I've seen witness ones. Yes, I've seen. Hey. So, but my auntie's marriage is different. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Even like they don't even quarrel often. Yeah, they're just happy. Mm. Yeah, actually, yeah, that's it. Oh yeah, but what have you learned? What are the things you've learned? Like, is there anything you've learned actually? <laughs> I don't have learned anything, but yeah, the fact that if people like your children, you really want to love your children. You really yeah, it's true, sure. I think I think he likes the children more. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I like my children, though, but I think my husband likes the children more than me. You mm know -hmm. what else? Like, just love. Yeah, love is there in marriage. Yeah. Okay, mm, that's an interesting question. I've never really thought about it from how. You people that are living with us, how you see us, it doesn't even cross my mind, Seth. I need to ask Lizzie this question. Sometimes men used to say that I wish I could marry someone that was exactly like uncle. Are you serious? 
I will tell him. <laughs> I will tell him. Let me make it awkward for every people in this house. <laughs> Have you ever stolen from me? No. Okay. That was very direct. No. <laughs> I think I should ask this question like this, right? When do you hope to get married? Actually, when I'm independent and I see married. Mind you, mind yeah. Anyway, that's the end of the video and all the questions. I actually like the way you answered, Cha. You tried to be honest, even though I feel like you still surface, surface answered some things. But but for the most part, she tried to be honest. So we are now going to head over to her channel, Amarachi Isaiah. Please, you guys should go and check it out. We're going to head over there where she's going to put me on the hot seat. Hey. Anyway, I'm not afraid of anybody. I'm just apologizing. Like beforehand, in case I ask anything annoying. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> is it not me that was in the video? If I don't want to, I will not put it. <laughs> but I don't mind, I don't mind, I'll answer. <clears throat> I'll answer. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you have any more questions for Amarachi, you guys should go and ask it on her channel and maybe she'll film a QA some other time. Okay? Yeah. No, alone now. Yeah. Yes, yes.